back to them Normans. Um, today's vlog is going to be a Aldi's haul. And um, I'm actually going to Aldi's and it's this other grocery store called Wright's Market. I'm going to Wright's Market to go get my meats. And for both of them, for Wright's and also Aldi's, I am going to be having a $140 budget. So, I'm so excited about showing y'all as far as like how much I actually got for just $140. That is going to be this budget for this grocery haul, which hopefully it will stretch. I'm, I'm hoping maybe three weeks, if not a month. And I do have some meals plans to go along with them. Um, so right now, I'm on my way to Aldi's. And next one that you will see is all the stuff that I have and will be at the house. So y'all, see y'all in the video.
back from doing my Aldi's grocery shopping and also rights. So we're going to start with rights. Okay. So I end up getting several packs. Let me see. I got eight packs of chicken wings because we love wings. We are a wing type family. So I usually get a lot of that. Um, I end up getting a pack of neck bones. Y'all, I love me some neck bones. Um, I got these beef chuck steaks, which was two of them. And I got three packs of chicken breasts, which I can always cut these and I can freeze them. And so I plan with the neck bones. I can have them with rice or, uh, I don't know. I just love neck bones. Y'all, I'm, I'm pitiful. And this right here, <laughs> this right here is a date night for me and Chris. Steak and potato. We may have that for dinner tonight. I'm not for sure. Um, I would love to use the chicken breast, cut up, slice them in half and put some cream of chicken or cream of mushrooms with it and also have some green beans with that. That would be a great dinner with that. All right, y'all. So this, oh, sorry. Let's go back. So this right here only cost me $58 and some change, which was at Wright's. Um, now, all these. Y'all, I don't know if my table can actually hold all of this stuff. But yeah, so I went over budget. But this right here is going to last for the whole month until maybe like the end of April. So let's start right over here because this right here is light and fluffy. So the tissues are 59 cents, which is four rolls. And it's basically like the Angel Soft off brand. Um, These paper towel was 49 cents. All right, y'all. Let's really get to it. I'm just overwhelmed just thinking about it. All right, so I got some vegetable oil, which was $1.81. Then we needed some more Parmesan cheese for whenever we have pasta nights and stuff. All right, um, the kids, I use pineapple chunks and also um, mandarin oranges. I got several of that and also the Jellos. I got several of those for the kids' snacks and stuff. And these cans were here with like 79 cents. And also the jello was like 85-ish cents. Then I also got us some Alfredo sauce, y'all. Ah! Which was $1.99. Hot sauce was 85 cents because we usually use it for the wings that we make. And again, um, we got I try to get a lot of mandarin oranges because it's a quick snack for the kids. This and I got some new things. That's why I kind of sort of went over budget. But this right here is for the classic fajita skillet. Ah, sauce. I cannot talk. But anyway, um, I want to try me some fajitas this time. Um, and we also have the beef burgers because usually we try to hurry up and we have like hamburger night. And the shrimps, uh, this right here was $6.99. No, I'm sorry, it was $4.99. I got it cheaper. Uh, with the shrimps, I can use that probably sometimes we really like to eat fried shrimp. And then I can use it for spaghetti as well. We needed some more ketchup. Um, we're going to have a family night where we're going to have like Rotel and cocktail weenies. So I got some of those, which is just a small one. I don't really want a big one. Um, now these cookies, <laughs> they're mommy cookies. And I got the kids some waffles for breakfast in the morning because usually they're like, I'm hungry. I'm hungry. Yeah. yeah. Um, and also for a family night, I got us a cake mix. Let the kids make a cake. And y'all know we got to have taco shells because we always have taco nights. And I still have, like I said, I have another hot sauce. A1 steak sauce. Y'all know we got to have it. And here is the tomato sauce. Well, sorry, the tomato basil and also garlic. Um, and I also got some salsa for our little snacks in between meals. Um, we have the eggs, which was a dollar fifty-five. Put my eggs over here. I don't want my eggs to fall. The grapes were one ninety-nine, and y'all know I have to get my eighty-nine cent salad because y'all know I love me some salad. And we use these pepperonis, which were one ninety-nine. We use them for the salads, and also I do want to do a baked spaghetti. And of course, you know we have to have potatoes because I love me some potatoes, or we can make some homemade fries. And we also had to get some hot dogs, something real quick, um, some cheese, of course. The children love chicken fries, so I made sure I got some of those. And, of course, got some taco seasoning. And I got some lemon pepper seasoning. Then we have garlic powder and also onion powder. All of those were there with just a dollar. 
And here is Velveeta cheese, which is a generic brand. This one here was $4.49. What I can do is make chicken spaghetti with some of this, but I know I want to use majority of it for Rotel. And here's the diced tomatoes for the whole Rotel. I got two of those. And we have the chicken breast strips, which we use these right here for salads, which they are awesome. But I also am probably going to use one pack for a fajita night. And I got two things of turkey breast because I love sandwiches. And also the kids, they love sandwich night. And I end up having to get some butter, of course. And this time I wanted to try this right here, something new. Campbell's Sauce Oven Cheesy Broccoli Chicken. And I can use the... um. Well, let me go with this one. I also have two things of broccoli, which that's what I plan on using with this. And also, I have the chicken breast. And this time, um, I have not had any chicken or fish this way in years. So, I really want to get that. I, I really want to try that again, at least with the kids since they're older and they recognize more now. And I had to get my favorite cereal, y'all. $1.39. Uh, yes. And also, some noodles. You know, we always have to have the pasta. Which was 79 cents. I end up getting two, but different types of pasta noodles because, like I say, we usually do spaghetti night, but we try to change it up. And also, don't forget, I have that shrimp. I can use that shrimp for the whole shrimp Alfredo and still put some broccoli with it. I end up getting two things of fries. Well, actually, three, but I want to do a, what is it called? Tater tot casserole. I want to do that one with this one. And, like, again, I got two things of fries for family night. I had to get my two loaves of bread for sandwiches or cheese toast in the morning. Then we got some chips for the whole Rotel. And also another thing for the salsa. And, y'all, I got to move all my stuff. It is horrible. Like, y'all, we, I did amazing. I went over budget by $50, but this is going to last for a whole month for a family of four, which is awesome, you guys. So, this this big pizza, it is 16 inches, and it was $5.99. So, I got the, the Mega Meat Pizza and the Sausage and Pepperoni. And I got some water. The water was like $2.49. But, yeah, y'all, so... I end up spending like $190, which is great, but I plan on making sure that that stretches all the way till like the end of April-ish. And also, y'all, I got these three pictures from Ross, and I just love them, so I want y'all to look at it, because <laughs> I'm coming up, you know, ooh, gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. I thought that was so nice, though. But again, y'all, thank you guys for my Aldi's and Wright's haul. Make sure you like, subscribe. Y'all, uh, I'm just so happy. Ah! But um, thank you guys again, and see you guys later.